Hi there, in today's video, you will learn how to create personalized Word documents from data in Excel quickly. And the simplest way to convert 10,000 invoices into PDF in 5 minutes. When it comes to sending mass mailings, mail merge can be real time saver. It allows you to quickly create custom letters, emails, or mailing labels in Word by merging information from your Excel spreadsheet. This video provides an overview of the main features as well as a step-by-step -step explanation of how to do a mail merge from Excel. Here, I have data of traders that shows the details of items, quantity, rate, and the text generated while purchasing the items. After you have set up and reviewed the source data spreadsheet, you have ready to run the mail merge. In this case, we will be combining invoice. Make a Microsoft Word documents. You can open an existing document if you have already made your own invoice format or you can create a new one if you haven't. Here, I have already created the format just by copying the data from Excel and paste it in the Word document. So let's see how we can do the mail merge. In the table tools, click on the mailings, start the type of merge you want to perform. Click on the start mail merge and you have see there are lots of options like letters, email, messages, envelopes, labels, directory or normal word document. Here we'll do the normal word document. So select normal word document. After that select recipients and as we have already an excel spreadsheet. So click use an existing list and browse the file and click OK. Now we have to merge the field as mentioned in the Excel spreadsheet. To do so, place the cursor where the personal information should appear in the invoice. Then click on the insert mail merge field and as we want to know the bill number, so select bill number for the date. To ensure that the recipient details appear correctly in the invoice, click on the preview result and to check the next details, just click on the right button. Here, if you can see the amount, it is not exactly the same which we have mentioned in the Excel spreadsheet like this. So for that, select the amount and right click on that. And click on the toggle field codes and right backslash hash comma 0, 0.00 for the two decimal digit and copy the formatting and paste it in every cell and click preview result here you can see the amount in two decimal digits if you are satisfied with all the previews result go to the finish group and select the finish merge button. From here you can choose to print the document or send them as email messages from this page. Let's see one by one. Edit individual documents. To make changes before printing or emailing. As you want to check all the details. So select all and click OK. Here a new document will open. And you will be able to make changes to each invoice individually. You can also print the documents if you want to convert your file into PDF format then go to the file menu click on the export and select create PDF publish it into the required location and it will open the PDF into the browser as you can see here Hopefully this information has been useful and now you understand how to properly perform mail merge from Excel to Word. Thank you for your time. Keep watching.